It annoys me that I kind of have the same reaction every time, but I can't help it. This is another loopable track. Um, he started with the hook, and we know that nobody cracks the hook every time like Talvinder. And there's this is a beautiful thing about him. He takes like one line or or two lines, and he will repeat them. And I think the song structure he follows is typically this: that 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 very earwormy line will start the track and end the track. Um, and it will have one line repeated twice. And then the second line repeated twice. So it kind of comes in that form and it just stays in your brain. It just stays in your brain and it's always so high on melody. It's always so high. It has that old school retro quality to it, you know, because it was always repeated in the hook line. One line is repeated in the hook line. And it sits so strongly in your mind that you remember the songs that you have to remember until now, right? Because of that quality. So that's what, that is... trademark the in there and again he did the same and he started so he is every song just just hits the heart and it like i've read this somewhere in one of his print interviews i think that he um was not happy with the kind of mainstream punjabi music that was coming out and he felt like it was taking it was moving away from emotions and warmth and just sweetness and that kind of stuff and i feel like if that's the mission he's on to bring that back into the punjabi music landscape then more power to him i'm here for it i freaking love this he has he has just he's just created his own space and his own niche in the scene and it's so so important that he keeps doing what he's doing because it's so required it's so required we need we need artists like this who believe in this like vision and who then stand by it no matter what and don't follow trends and that kind of stuff so yay absolute gem of an artist and another feather in his cap